Hello, and welcome to Spotlight on the Scriptures. We're looking at part of the Gospel, uh, Matthew, the 14th chapter, 28 through 30. I am Pastor Dan Wickard at Emmanuel Lutheran in Granbury, Texas. Now, this, uh, these verses are part of a longer narrative where Peter walks on water. So Jesus is out on the boat. They're on the Sea of Galilee. And they have just witnessed Jesus walking on water. So Peter uh, asks Jesus if Jesus could ask him, command him, to get out on the water. And uh, Jesus said, okay, come on. So Peter got out of the boat, and he was walking on water. He was doing what he realized was no doubt impossible, but he was doing it anyway. So what had happened is as he was walking on water, the wind started to pick up. The environment got a little bit too scary. And Peter noticed the change in the environment, the change in the wind. And he got scared, as no doubt anyone would. And he responded by asking Jesus to save him. Now, it's easy, or one of the ways that we can look at this is to take a look at this as uh, Peter had faith in Jesus. Com Jesus commanded him. He walked, and then his doubts started to creep in. And he started to question whether he could walk on water. But I think one, th and all of that is true and good lessons from this. This is a good lesson about uh, faith and doubt and how uh, God will overcome uh, our doubt. But one little thing I want to point out that's interesting is when Peter began to have doubts of whether he could do this, he didn't try to swim. He didn't try to uh, run quickly to get back in the boat. He asked God to save him. He asked Jesus, save me. Because something has changed and, and I, I don't know if I can keep doing this. Will you please save me, Jesus? Because that faith in, in Jesus, that faith in the God, the, the friend of Peter who was there, that didn't seem to waver because Peter still believed that Jesus was there for him and would indeed save him. Amen.